legacy of wisdom is a powerful resource for melting deep experience into knowledge, benefiting society across all the ages of generations. In today's day and age, as many more of us getting old, um, there's going to be a lot more so-called old people having to live together in new kinds of uh, communities. Um, so as we retire, do you have anything you could say about what kinds of elements we should be paying attention to as we age in terms of a lifestyle for our later years? What are those pieces that we should begin to look at? My answer is predicated upon my life's work. Namely, as we age, for many, stress is a feature. Namely, I can't do what I used to be able to do. I'm no longer healthy enough to enjoy life. Uh, what does that mean with my relationships? How am I going to deal with illness and, and passing on? We can be helped in making and answering those questions or thinking about those questions by getting the effects of stress out of the way. So my own personal um, advice would be to have people evoke the relaxation response on a regular basis, which will make them calmer and more able to deal with the vicissitudes of changes that aging brings about. Is there something that you could say about if I'm going to make a conscious decision about how I'm going to live my life, stress out of the way included, of course, what kinds of things should I be pay paying attention to? Or is it really that's the key point? I don't think I'm able to answer that question, how a given individual will approach that. But what I can say is by being calmer, by getting stress out of the way, you're more, you'll be able to make a more um, inclusive and perhaps not stress-altered decision about what to do. You can, we're so different as individuals. What was important to us uh, earlier is no longer important to us. That'll have to be factored in, but you'll be able to deal with that better by having the injurious, um, often devious manifestations of stress out of the way. Thank you. Thank you.